Knowing when to stop a fat loss phase is a seriously underrated key to long-term success. Dieting is a stress on the body, and doing it for a long period of time can cause decreases in testosterone, estrogen, and thyroid, having serious effects on your long-term health. It affects everyone differently, so there's no hard and fast rule on this, but I personally like to aim to lose no more than 10% of my body weight per dieting period. So for example, if I weighed 100 kilos, I'd stop dieting after losing 10 kilograms. And if I weighed 60 kilos, I'd stop dieting after losing six kilograms. It might not sound like much, particularly if you've got a lot of body fat to lose, but I've personally found that splitting it up into smaller phases like this makes it a lot less challenging from a mental perspective and it seems to limit the amount of negative health effects that come from extended dieting. Between each dieting period, I like to spend half the amount of time that I spent dieting back at maintenance calories. So if it took me six weeks to lose six kilos, I would then spend three weeks back at maintenance calories before starting my next chunk of dieting.